Hello and welcome to the tutorial on ordinal numbers. In this tutorial we're going to cover numbers up to 50. To begin with we're going to have a quick recap of the numbers from the 1st to the 20th. We're not going to do all of them but this is to illustrate how we work out the remainder up to 50th. So let's start with the first one. We've got first ends with a st second ends with an nd third ends in rd and then we got fourth fifth and the rest remain the same up to tenth they all end with a th so the first three it's first with an st second with an nd i'm just going to underline that so that it's clear from that first, second, third. All the remainder end with a th. We're now going to look at the numbers from 11 to 20. So let's write this down. We've got 11th, notice how it ends with a th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, and the rest are the same up to 20th. Now notice how all of them from 11 to 20 end with a th. We're now going to do numbers 21 to 30. So let's go through this. We've now got 20. Now, how do you think this should be written? It's actually written with an ST. It's 21st. 21st. The next one, 22nd. 22nd. The one after that is 23rd. You notice they're following the same pattern as this one the very first numbers from 1 to 10. So we've got 23rd, 20, and this is going to end with a TH. So it's following the first ones. 24th, and now 25th, and we carry on all the way down to 30th. So the first three, and let's just underline them so we can highlight them. 21st, 22nd, 23rd. All the remaining ones end with a th, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, and 30th. Now let's look at the next one. From 31 to 40. Now how do you think this looks? I'm just going to cross this out and change colors. We've got 31st. 32nd, 33rd, 34th, 35th, and they carry on all the way down to 40th. So this line also follows the first one. The only one which is different are from 11th to 13th. They end with a th. All the others follow the same principle as the first one, as the numbers from 1 to 10. We got 31st, 32nd, in fact we'll underline it just to highlight it. We've got 31st, 32nd, 33rd. All the, all the rest end with a th, 34th, 35th, Okay, and the last line we're going to do from 41 to 50. I'm sure you can work this out. We got 40 first, 40 second, 40 third, 40 fourth, 40 fifth, all the way down to 
But again, let's highlight them. 41st, 42nd, and 43rd. All the rest end with a TH. So this line, and I'm just going to change back to the original color, also follows the very first one here. So you notice, now have a quick recap of these. If we've got 1st, 2nd, 3rd, all the way down to 10th, the 11th, the blue line, a blue column, 11th, 12th, 13th are different. All the rest of them, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 31st, 32nd, 33rd, 41st, 42nd, 43rd. In fact, what you can do is to use a slightly different color and you can just look at the first line. So have a look at the very first line. You've got 1st, 11th, and then you've got 21st, 31st, 41st. Now have a look at the next line. You've got 2nd, the only one which is different is 12th. And then you keep going, is 22nd, 32nd, 42nd. The next line, 3rd, we've got 13th, 23rd, 33rd, and 43rd. And all the rest are the same. So you've got 4th, 14th, 24th, 34th, 44th. So those are the ordinal numbers up to 50.